All right, so I'm going to be giving a tip on how to set custom ringtones and notification sounds on the Galaxy Z Flip 3 and Fold 3. Now, this is always one of the first things I change whenever I get a new phone, and while Samsung makes this very easy for ringtones, notification sounds are a whole nother ball game. All right, so the first thing you want to do, though, is go into your settings, click on sounds, and then you're going to see the ringtone option. So from in here, you're going to see a little plus icon. Literally, all you have to do is tap that, and as long as you've got some music already downloaded onto your phone, you can just select it, and now you've got a custom ringtone. Now, for notification sounds, for whatever reason, Samsung makes this extremely difficult. So when you click on notification sounds, you're not going to find a plus icon. I mean, we could scroll all the way to the bottom here, and we're just not going to find it. So the only way to set custom notification sounds, you have to actually go into your Samsung My File folder. So Samsung's got its own, you know, folder right here you just want to click on it and then you want to click on my files so what you need to do at this point is look or go into the internal storage option i'm already in it and you're going to want to find the music you've already downloaded on your phone so for example it could be in the downloads maybe it's in your music mine is actually in the music i believe here and wh whenever you found the song that you want to use as a notification sound hold down on it and then you want to click the move option at the bottom. Now, what you need to do is move this song into your notification folder. So that's what I'm going to do right here. All right, I'm going to have it drop in here. And basically now it should show up in your settings, in your notification sounds. So we're going to go back into our settings, sounds, notification sounds. Okay, and uh, I think it should be, let's see if it's at the bottom where they put it, or it might actually be at the top. Let me go back up to the top here. Let me scroll up here. Okay, boom, there it is right there. Okay, so that's all you gotta do, guys. It's just a little bit of an extra step to get those custom notification sounds, but you know, doing this is totally worth it. And like I said, this is these are a couple things I always change whenever you get a new phone. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the tip. Subscribe to the channel, uh, you know, and we'll see you in the next one.